Last year BMW showed up with a black and white ink tech car. This year I'm impressed, I like the design way more. Looks like an older Fiat, but on steroids, wider wings, you know, wider body kit, way better design and with all these crazy colors flickering. It is super cool. Dodge also came out with an electric model and I hope to see more info soon. They didn't answer any questions, just showed off the car. Very small stand, crammed in between, you know, the lines. But the Peugeot, again, crazy big platform right in the middle of the building. Big stand, big lights, huge presentation, crazy design. This car looks like a spaceship, it's just like from the future. Really surprised with this aero design. But at the same time, DeLorean, still really poor presentation. It was jammed on the corner of the building. Uh, really poor booth, right? Nothing there around. Uh, I think presentation-wise, it deserves more. And the car just looks stunning. I think they killed it with the design. This year at CES 2023, we presented a lot of new, extremely interesting, futuristic design cars. But from all of them, one stood out, and I think this is the most craziest design I have seen so far, and I was not expecting this insanely cool idea to come from the DeLorean team. The motors are plastic and you can see pieces falling apart, but anyway, the idea and how the suspension is placed, definitely not something that would work or ever be produced, but looks beautiful and impressive. The lines, the rear and front parts with the lights and transitions are super cool. So this thing is sick guys, look at this thing. So. These are the lights, and look at this sick tires. This thing is insane, and you have ejection here. Look at the suspension. This is freaking crazy suspension, and it's like horizontally placed. And uh, no windows, <laughs> no wipers. And uh, you have butterfly doors. Look at this thing. This is sick. This is something that I would drive every day <laughs> if I could afford it and if they would uh, make this as a you know regular car. This is so much cooler than anything ever I've seen so far. The Cybertruck is like a, a baby toy compared to this. Look at the slides. They nailed it with the design. And we have this Mercedes back here. Look at the sick suspension. Holy moly. This thing is wild. And the suspension actually allows to go up and down. This is sick. Look at this thing here. And you have, looks like hub motors. Yeah, this is plastic, it's not a real tire. But still, design-wise, this thing is insane. This is crazy. Wow. <laughs> yeah, design-wise they nailed it. This is probably the best looking car I've seen so far. And look at this, I don't know if it's a spoiler or what the hell this is. Look how it's stretching in the back. And this is sick. Wow. It's like a freaking flying machine, you know? <laughs> Give it to Xpang and they'll, you know, add some propellers, some wings, and you'll make a flying car out of this shape.
every single angle it has a twist, a turn, it is the same. Oh yeah, the this one, right? Yeah, nice. Crazy amazing, that's that you said it right. And then you need our interior. <laughs> uh, I mean, our I'm actually confident if somebody designed this look and this aspect, I'm sure inside will be super cool. Excuse me, sir, are you with DeLorean? No, I'm not from DeLorean, from Italian Design, but I can tell you something about that. Yeah, tell us, tell us as much as possible, we want to hear it. This is uh, a concept uh, model, uh, vision of Italian Design for the DeLorean of 2030. So, so for now it's just a mock-up model. But it will be produced ever? Or? No, no. no. So what's the point of making design if it will be produced? It's to show our vision of uh, what it could look like in the future. Yeah, but I, will, I mean, make it so I can buy it. I want to buy this thing. <laughs> like, we can make it something. If you want one, we can make one. Yeah, but that'll cost millions of dollars. Exactly. So we propose the... design studies and if, if the people like and if there's enough yes. good feedback. We love it. <laughs> I can tell you that everybody yeah. likes it. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Yeah, this is awesome. It would be nice if you guys would go extra mile and make like you know, open doors, a little bit of interior so it can you know this feel it. This is just the beginning, yes. It's if the beginning. there is a positive feedback, the Laura might think of uh, thinking of going in production. Going of further. course, this is, there's some technical stuff that is not 100% feasible. Example, it's not the real, that, it's not going to work, yes, right? Exactly, so. If you get a lot of feedback, right, yep. and people love it, and let's say you are thinking to, to get close to, you know, to creating one, yep. how long will it take, how much will it cost? Usually a development of a car takes between three, four years. It depends if you start from an existing platform, uh, existing battery system management. So there are so many variables that need to be considered. And it's, let's say estimation-wise, like how much... if. If DeLorean, I mean the company, it's design company, the production company, right? And investors will be like all, you know, combined uh, team, right? If they make this a reality, they, I mean, they decide to go in production, how much will this cost to start the process? And how much will unit cost? This one we cannot really Nobody tell. knows. That's no, exactly. It's really, really, at the beginning, it's just a design study, not much. I see, I see. I'm sure somebody from Saudi will see this and will probably, you know, make you guys make it. <laughs> we are here. If there's someone interested in one-offs or a small production. But let's say if somebody it. say, I want to buy it tomorrow or I want to buy it, like, you know, not tomorrow, but let's say I want to uh, make this uh, real, how much does that cost? One million. So, not much more than one million, definitely. Range between uh, two and uh, four. Two and four? four? Uh, yes. That's actually not a lot. I was expecting oh, exactly. more. Yeah. It depends on the contents and what... Specs, right? Yeah. Exactly. So, it's really difficult to make an estimation right now. But. I see. Well, great job. This looks thank stunning. You. This you. is really, you know, like I feel like this is the best design I've seen so far. But thank you, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you for your visit.